Hey guys, what's up? It's Chris here, I Touch iPods, and today I have a review to do for you guys on the Cyclops cases from CyclopsHQ.com. So, without further ado, let's go ahead and get straight on. Well, I think you get the point. To the world's famous. Alright guys, so like I said, I have the two Cyclops cases here to review for you guys. Um, I'm recording this video with the Flip Minnow HD, so please watch this video in HD somewhere around down there. Um, so, let's go ahead and get into this first one. This first one is called Sydney, and really quickly, the second one is called uh, the Black Eyes case. The Black Eyes. Um, if I'm not exactly correct on any of these... Uh, I should be somewhere near, or I'll put a little thing on the video somewhere, but that's pretty much what they uh, are called. So we'll go ahead and take this first one out of its packaging. And really quickly, if you are interested in these products, you can go over to CyclopsHQ.com. The link will be in the video description. And both of these cases are available on sale for $19.99. So, so for just around $20, you could pick up um, one of these cases. Okay? So let's start out with Sydney. Sydney uh, is a purple case that looks very, um, almost girlish and very cute if you want to say that. Um, it comes, all these come with uh, like a little monster code that's on the back of it. Uh, you can get that and get monster moves on their website. Thanks, Mac. You can get monster moves on their website and all that stuff. There's more to it than just these cases at Cyclops HQ. I mean, they have iPhone apps and all that, so go ahead and check out um, CyclopsHQ.com if you're interested. And as you guys can tell, this is a silicone case that's going to move each way. It's not going to stretch that much, so it is pretty good silicone. Um, it has a little Cyclops HQ on the inside. Not so sure if you guys can see that. I'll zoom in for you guys. It's a Cyclops, Cyclops HQ on the inside. Um, on the back here, you have just a little face with the red lips and the cool little hair and the eye. Uh, it's very simple to apply these cases, which is pretty cool. You just put your iPod in one side, then find each corner and just stretch it around, then massage the rest of the case into place. Once you have massaged the case into place on your iPod Touch 2G, um, your volume rockers are very nicely lined up. You guys can see the volume going up and down, hopefully, right there. Very simple to access those. They're very nicely separated, which is neat, uh, so you know which is which when you're pressing them. And your power on and off switch and your sleep button also very very easy accessible along with your home button and your screen okay um, on the back of your iPod you guys can see the curve it's a very form-fitting case not too much slack on it except for around the edges here because it's not that tight of a silicone so you can get it on easier which is actually pretty neat it does have a nice little lay on the table design so it does have that lip right there this this camera doesn't have the autofocus so I can't bring it up here and have it autofocus for you guys but there you can see the camera but um, <laughs> Down here on the bottom, you have your fully open dock and your headphone jack, so you can sing, charge, listen to your music at the same time with this case on. Um, the case offers a lot of grip, too, because of the silicone that it is, um, so you're going to get a nice little grip on this case while you're holding your iPod. Uh, it's going to feel very nice. Obviously, it's going to have some nice shock absorption because of the silicone. So let's go ahead and throw on the other case that Cyclops was nice enough to provide me with. This case is my favorite one out of the two. Um, it's just because all the wacky, cool designs of all the different eyes on the back. Let's see if I can zoom in here for you guys. All the different wacky designs of all the different eyes on the back look really neat. All the different colors um, standing out from the black background look really cool. Um, on the back, excuse me, on the side here, you still have the same form-fitting design with the Vime Rockers, the power, and the home button. You also have your dock open and accessible. Um, this silicone is also very smooth. It is a little bit more rugged on the back because of all the designs. Let's see if you guys can hear that. Hopefully you guys can hear that. It's a little bit more rugged because of all the designs, but they do look really cool. The, the white going to each eyeball, sticking out from the black, looks really cool. It's actually a really neat design. If you're into this kind of stuff, this is definitely something you should go ahead and check out. Um, same thing with the lay on the table design, the little bit of this extra silicone 
that kind of flabs off on the top, on the sides, and on the bottom. Not that big of a deal. I've seen worse cases. Um, but this is actually a pretty neat case for $20. And if you're into silicone cases and this website, definitely go and check these products out at CyclopsHQ.com. Once again, like I said, for $19.99. Let me know what you guys think of these cases in a comment down below or possibly a video response. Tell me what you think of them. They're both silicone. They're both going to give you shock absorbent, scratch protection, all the things silicone cases usually do. And they'll also give you a nice little cool flare design to your iPod, unlike any other case. So if you're interested, once again, CyclopsHQ.com. All the links you will need over there in the sidebar or down bar, whatever you guys want to call it. But thanks for watching this video, guys. I will see you all later. Favorite, comment, rate, subscribe. Once again, everyone have a wonderful night. A peace.